Hi hey guys, it's time for another Brutal plus 6, we were rolling random and got Dead of Night and got this set up. Minesweeper, Blizzard and Void Rifts. Now, uh, you definitely uh, have to take care of the Rifts because Myla is fun, but if you get uh, like 16, 20 plus uh, Rifts open, and set even Swan can defend this. So. Uh, going out to deal with the rifts is pretty much not an option because we have both uh, mines, Beethoven and spider mines, and blizzards uh, roaming around the map. So uh, uh, we had to bunk at home and do it uh, with this setup. My life was heavy weapon specialist. Okay, I would have probably gone uh, uh, Grease Monkey here, but okay, it's, it's okay. And. Um, I was uh, Galactic Gun Runners. Now, some people uh, like to go gun, Galactic Gun Runners normally on Dead of Night because you have more platforms. But actually, in normal game, uh, in normal uh, game, when you just have to deal with uh, infested uh, structures, uh, you better go P1, uh, P1, uh, Han and Horner, uh, Chaotic Power Couple, because uh, platforms cost more. The downside is b cost 100% more instead of 100-100, they cost 200-200. So by the time you get to 10, actually, uh, like uh, with, ca with Chaotic Power Couple, uh, you would get to 10 a lot faster and you will actually clear um, more than half a map uh, with them. So it kind of evens up in the end uh, and uh, like you pretty much the same time when you can clear the map with these two prestiges uh, and of course chaotic power couple is better because you uh, wanna defend uh, you, you you then m may help defending like uh, uh, you can help defending uh, because you have a uh, uh, better mag mines, also stronger death effects uh, with your rid of mines or hel hellions, so uh, you can help ally defend better. That's why chaotic power couple is usually better here, but this time I needed galactic gun runners because I had to tend to both rifts. And uh, okay, you see the mag mines uh, normally chaotic power couple would uh, help to clear this, but now uh, yeah, they are slow so. Uh, and these uh, blizzards can actually uh, get red here because blizzards will white out. You see, there are safe zones in, ba in our base, but then they again become red. And when they are red, they deal damage and slow our units. So, okay, at least I soften up this uh, rift. Okay, so first you need a galleon as soon as possible, of course, gases. And uh, then you need an armory, there is a condition for the strike fighters. And then you start building uh, platforms and. Uh, and uh, fusion core too because you need a, a napalm payload okay so i was worried actually at the beginning of the game then you see this sensor tower if there are mines in the range of the sensor tower this kind of bug that uh, they they unburrow and then come to your base i don't know maybe this was fixed i'm not sure but uh, uh, i remember one game when there were mines here and they just uh, and sensor towers saw them. I mean, they were seen on the minimap. Um, I think in Versus, actually, the cloak units are not uh, visible by sensor tower, but uh, I think these ones uh, they were shown here. And they unburrowed and come to LA's mineral line, and that was really bad. Now we were able to recover, but with this set of mutators, if that happened, that would be game over. So uh, uh, this didn't happen, and we could play. Uh, okay, so uh, oh, I didn't saturate this. I think I realized that at some point of time. Uh, but uh, good thing is now uh, this is good, very good synergy because uh, yeah, ally defense, but also uh, went for drone master. In that laser master, you see laser is not yet finished, and this was a good decision because uh, he he needs tanks, so he needs gas, and I also need gas. Like this helps me immensely to. Uh, to get more platforms because you always have more minerals than gas usually yeah okay yeah now I saturated this last one and uh, now I'm building platforms and I can start uh, dealing with this okay I use this because this also clears some structures here and I believe it will also kill this one yeah okay uh, okay now we have rifts here now rifts also don't spawn near our mineral lines but this is kind of this is pretty big uh, base uh, 
weak space so they can spawn here and in, uh, and here on this uh, cliff so yeah now I need to uh, deal with this okay uh, have some magmines to have laser also helps here yeah without laser it, it would be hard because I didn't have, think I had a single rimper or so now with the galleon and uh, uh, this repair and I was able to uh, uh, clear that rift. Okay, so now these first rifts are clear, but you can see now there are three more rifts because that's already the second spawn, and the third one will occur uh, wait second or yeah, I think this actually third one already. Uh, or wait, two two twenty three fifty uh, five twenty. Yeah, this is now fourth spawn, and this is the last one I think on uh, uh, with two rifts, and next ones will be four rift spawns. Okay, so um, Napalm Payload uh, is, I did of course already finished it, is very important because you can see that uh, uh, did, uh, it does uh, strike fighters deal 175 pl and plus 225 to non-heroic. So they, they deal uh, 400 damage plus 100 damage over time, that's enough to kill these structures because they have 500 HP. Rifts also have 500, but they are heroic, so only 175, so you need one strike, this little bit of fire damage, then second strike, so it stacks uh, up and then, uh, yeah, more than like, uh, this, uh, you, ha you have like 150 at least damage by fire, plus the 350 damage by uh, strikes, and then it will uh burn uh, down or three strikes to kill it immediately okay so um yeah uh, i of course had the radio um mastery i had uh, the hell uh, mastery of uh, significant other bonus in case i had to build some uh Corners units, but I mean I don't benefit from double salvage because Ella is not losing anything. His tanks are behind turrets, and I'm keeping my stuff at home, so uh, it is uh, is pretty uh, useless to use double salvage chance. And uh, yeah, now they are still not sending flying units, but they will start sending flying units. So it's important to have defenses even uh, like on this. Uh, Okay, this was unfortunate, this stalker blinked here, but okay, well, I spotted it and uh, lasered it down. It's only, I believe, killed one of my uh, SCVs. Uh, now I already have, now I've reached uh, over this number of tensor. So now, now I can start uh, killing the, killing the uh, infested structures. Of course, with chaotic power couple, I would like have two or three for that. I would have to spend eight for the rift so it would take forever uh, so finally uh, time for galactic gun runners to shine okay I didn't even get uh, I was contemplating use uh, going for raven upgrades and taking ravens but I don't need it <gasps> like Eli has uh, this uh, setup okay we did have Terran enemies we can get nukes as you see that's a raiding party but I think it was handled pretty pretty well. I did get plus one in case like for this reef spawn or if I had to have to uh, help. So I started this upgrade. So I have a little bit more uh, combat potential on this uh, aliens and reapers. But as you can see, this is all that I built. I think I built one more galleon later, and that was all. Okay. Okay, these fleet maneuvers, that's actually uh, pretty bad timing, I must admit. I uh, just when I started, I should have uh, used it uh, earlier uh, during daytime because now a lot of these shots are wasted on the infested, as you can see. Uh, otherwise, it would be a lot more damage. I did have that mastery, of course, because uh, mag mines are not very useful here. And uh, yeah, this is, uh, look at it, this was uh, my bed over here. Otherwise, I think all these structures would be destroyed, but now nah, just mostly wasted on infested. Okay, and um, now we have a pretty okay. I will speed this up because not much to show. Uh, okay, and what's 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 also important? Okay, and now they, they have siege tanks. So yeah, I mean it's not so important to kill them fast. 
If I did Swan ally, okay, this was fortunate spawn, like Tourette's uh, dealt with this and my Magmines. But uh, it's important to keep them in check, not to get like uh, get them open for too long. Uh, they spawn uh, trickles. Every trickles are uh, uh, like one, two, two zerglings or one marine or one zealot every 12 seconds. Or okay, it's, if, if it's a zealot, then actually it's next trickle will be uh, uh, every uh, next uh, in the next 24. Next one will be uh, after 24 uh, seconds. Uh, but uh, spawns are first spawn is uh, f uh, 30 seconds after the rift spawned, and uh, and the uh, next ones then will be in the intervals of the 90 seconds, 90, not 19, so it's yeah, every minute and a half. Okay, um, so that's pretty much it. Okay, there are some these rifts are open for a long time. I think, uh, yeah, uh, on Magura's map, this thing is these things are white, and it really helps because now you have these buildings, all enemy buildings, un units, all uh, enemy units are red. Blizzards are also red when they are uh, not in our bases when the, they are dealing damage. So uh, it's sometimes hard to spot these red uh, red things on the mini map. So yeah, there we have one rift here, one rift here, one rift here, uh, one rift here, yeah. But uh, eventually, like, this is... Um, uh, okay, this nuke, this nuke was... Uh, you see the ghost here, and I was fortunately... I know that they usually come from here, because this is the enemy base. In the nuke cells are there. Okay, so... Uh, it was a really fortunate spot at the edge of this uh, shadow, so I was able to spot it and uh, kill it with the f a strike fighter. I was probably able to uh, kill these things because it's out of the detection range of this turret. Okay, so uh, okay, this is very fortunate spawn two rifts killed immediately, and I'm dealing with this uh, rest of them. Okay. Okay, finally I'll kill this one and, uh, and this one. Okay, actually laser helped. Laser helped pretty pretty much. So that that's also pretty good. So I don't have to even delay between shots because laser adds that those 50 missing uh, 50 uh, missing damage. Okay, so you see this uh, one shot killed four structures. So you always have to want to shot between them. Okay, because there is enough space. Of course, for that you need. Uh, that's why I have a radius. Uh, the, the the mastery. Uh, okay, so now it's um, good portion already cleaned. Uh, I used the uh, fleet over here to clean the rest of them here. We didn't go for bonus, of course, because uh, we go for bonus and. Um, yeah, Rift save armor one, but the strike fighters think ignore, yeah, they ignore armor. And, uh, Ally now has, see, in the meantime, okay, you didn't see this and you showed it, there was a Muta here that actually killed a lot of my SCVs, I didn't, ma didn't notice that. But the uh, okay thing is, uh, I uh, already f float a lot of resources, and now I pretty much have enough, I have at least, uh, like 24 uh, platforms, okay, even 25, some are not, uh, yeah, I think more than 25, I think actually I got uh, 31 built, so now I can kind of st stop, I think this was all I stopped uh, building them at this point, maybe I'll build two more over here, uh, because I want, to, this is kind of enough, and I want to leave Eli some room for maneuvering over here, for his defenses, uh, so yeah, now we have enough for dealing with uh, both rifts and these uh, and these uh, structures. Okay. Okay, this rift. Oh no, this is I think. Uh, yeah, I killed the original one. This is the new one. They tend to spawn on clear ground. Uh, the, you see, this is uh, there. There are a lot of uh, enemy structures here. This is not clear enemy units. No, the structure is actually not important, but where there are enemy units, rifts tend to spawn fa away from enemy units. So you see, this is in the corner, not here, because here are still enemy units, uh, and here is cleared. So I mean, uh, there's still I think stuff over here. 
I mean the enemy uh, units because of course that we didn't kill them, we just focused on structures. Okay, this was pretty cute. Now I did uh, a few strikes and then need this now provides vision for a... Uh, okay, Magma is also do it and provides vision for a la Okay, this stays visible for some time actually, so it was just enough for laser to kill it. Okay, uh, f this was fortunate that we didn't have stanks because it didn't have take some time to kill those things. Okay, I don't know if actually the laser slows the stanks. I kind of forgot about it. That's uh, um, I think it actually does, and I'm not sure. Stanks are my bosses, so it might not. Okay. I mean, Heroes of the Storm are also, I think, my bosses, but they, they, they are uh, slowed by laser. I mean, with uh, heavy weapon specialists. So now we have easy game, and Ella even starts building the... Building the... Okay, this is still flying, but Ella will, uh, think, uh, yeah, okay. <laughs> uh, drop this over here to... Start building Hercules because they, then he can use tactical jumps and of course the, if there are no mines there, with of mines to kill the Hercules, then we're able to provide vision. Takes uh, 10 seconds for laser to uh, for laser to uh, kill the structure. Fully upgraded okay, laser is 50 damage, so it's uh, 10 seconds. Okay, so uh, yeah, he is doing it. You see now clearing the rifts. No, this one too. Okay, this one got hit by some mines, but survived. Hercules, okay, 600 HP, so I can survive one shot. This big dome oh, need uh, more shots, but okay, in, the, in time with this many platforms now, and Ally helping with the rifts, now it will be done pretty fast. Okay, this is actually not necessary here, here because I, I got it over here, but... Uh, and now we just have... Okay, this was really good. Uh, I uh, First uh, strike is not always precise because you need to just uh, to get vision of where the structures are, but fortunately I was able to hit right here between these two, so <laughs> this was a perfect strike. And now I just have... Okay, this I killed three with this one. And now uh, this is GG. This is the game uh, done. And speaking of Minesweeper, if you didn't know, they also don't appear in the, the, the base. But where they are, when their expansion, expansion is not safe zone uh, for the Minesweeper. So, I mean, there is no expansion of Dead of Night, but uh, maybe the, they, there are expansions. Uh, Widow Mines can be there. And there is uh, 25 patches uh, uh, replaced at start of the game uh, uh, across the map, each containing... Uh, each containing five widow mines and uh, seven spider mines, and they cannot be stacked one up, uh, one uh, upon each uh, upon other. Uh, it has to be distance of eight eight uh, squares uh, uh, between the centers of two uh, minefields. Okay, that's it, uh, guys. Uh, that was it, GG. And uh, let me just. Uh, Okay, uh, okay, this is a replay, so I can score screen, but uh, okay, I hope uh, uh, it will be now visible uh, over here. Let me uh, show you the... Uh, okay, let me see if it's shown over here. Oh, it says no data, okay. I don't know why in my OBS it show no data when I can clearly see see it uh, on ground. Okay, let me. Uh, ah, this is the f okay. Okay, now it's shown. Now it is uh, shown on my OBS, so now you probably can. Uh, you should be able to see it. Okay, uh, so. Uh, yeah, kills wise and APM wise, yeah, I like has more because of course he was defending, and uh, I don't need a lot of APM. I just need to uh, just need my uh, to do my job, and my job is of course to attend the rifts and uh, 
uh, infested structures. Okay, melee uh, kill decent number to uh, kill 235 and he shot down tw 22 rifts. Few of them with uh, Hercules laser combo uh, late game, but most of them uh, just spawns near his static D, so they were killed off immediately. Uh, these mines were collateral victims because he never uh, went for them, he was just killed by fire. Uh, or ally static D and uh, of course 137 to 40 and he also helped with killing few of these but uh, they were my job so uh, nice division of duties uh, uh, okay um, magma you see magma is have 540 kills now this sounds really strange Maybe they kill clumped of enemies, but uh, 540. I don't know why. I mean, okay, strike fighters they only use targeted structures, so this is like some collateral victims. But 540 by mag mines. This is um, I don't know. I don't know where where did that came from. But okay, maybe it was. Okay, a lot of small infested, and um, okay, 31 platform. Uh, two SL galleons. I only lost four reapers fighting those uh, in initial uh, rift spawns uh, in the base. But there was no static D yet there, and well, I didn't lose a single thing. You see, this Ares is just a uh, combat drop. But yeah, he didn't lose a single thing. It doesn't say here about uh, uh, spinning disease, but I think he didn't lose a single one too. So it was really a good uh, game. Okay. Uh, that's it guys, uh, pretty good synergy uh, and yeah, pretty good job, not even uh, very hard. So yeah, thanks for uh, watching, like and subscribe if you liked it and uh, watch my other videos too.